How's it going everybody? Bobo back here with the 39 John Deere B project. I think where I left off we had got one little putt out of the engine because I didn't have the oil filter set up. So I think with a trip to the local John Deere dealership and about three trips to our local salvage yard i think i finally got myself an oil filter set up um, just doing a little video here on some of the things i found uh, i'd had to we had had that broken stud so i went down found two or three tractors that had the longer stud in it like like this one this is the original stud that was broke off and uh the tractor that I got that stud out of had this filter laying on it. Now this, I believe, is more than likely the filter, the metal filter that's washable. Um, that would have been an original style filter and which is no longer available. So they went to a regular cartridge style. But I tried to use this and I just, I couldn't get any setup to work. And I'm thinking, I don't know for sure, I'm gonna keep searching to see if somebody can tell me. I think, I think they must have used a deeper cup on this because no matter what I did, you still had about three quarters of an inch between this and the, the base of the engine. So I looked at a lot of the other tractors down there and um, they had the shorter studs. So I grabbed a shorter stud and this is up in my tractor, but you see this filter size now, this thing goes in there. I couldn't figure out how that was gonna seal on the, put the oil down through there. So I got to looking, all the other ones down there had a washer up in there that would seal on the top of this to seal it off on the top end. So I went down the trip again, found this washer, couldn't get it off, couldn't figure out why. So I couldn't get mine out, so I made this little adapter jig for my homemade puller. Got it up in there, pulled it out, and noticed that you'll see these little dimples on there. That washer gets pounded up over top of them, and that keeps them from coming off. So. Made him out a trip down there today. Got my puller on this one. Got a washer. Got a shorter stud. I did a pre-fit up there, put everything together. Looks like it's gonna work really good. So we're gonna uh, go back in there, put everything all back together, and uh, see if we can get this thing to fire up, and uh, we'll make another video on that. So thanks for watching. Uh, we'll talk to you later.